Draco is a family of hypergolic liquid rocket engines designed and built by SpaceX for use in their space capsules. Two engine types have been built to date, Draco and Super Draco. The original Draco thruster is a small rocket engine for use on the Dragon spacecraft. Super Draco is derived from Draco and utilizes the same storable, non-cryogenic propellant as the small Draco thrusters, but are over 100 times larger in terms of delivered thrust. The much larger Super Draco engines have been used on the Crew Dragon spacecraft to provide launch escape capability to low Earth orbit. Draco and Super Draco combine the functions of both a reaction control system and a main propulsive engine. Topic: <laughs> Draco. Draco thrusters generate 400 newtons, 90 pounds force of thrust using a storable propellant mixture of monomethyl hydrazine fuel and nitrogen tetroxide oxidizer. The Draco thrust is comparable to the Marquardt R4D engine developed for the Apollo service and lunar modules in 1960s and used for apogee, perigee maneuvers, orbit adjustment and attitude control. 18 Draco thrusters are used on the Dragon spacecraft for attitude control and maneuvering. Topic: <laughs> Super Draco. On February 1, 2012, SpaceX announced that it has completed the development of a new, more powerful version of a storable propellant rocket engine, this one called Super Draco. This high thrust hypergolic engine about 200 times larger than the Draco RCS thruster hypergolic engine offers deep throttling ability and just like the Draco thruster, has multiple restart capability and uses the same shared hypergolic propellants. Its primary purpose is for SpaceX's LAS launch abort system on the Dragon spacecraft. According to the NASA press release, the engine has a transient from ignition to full thrust of 100 ms. During launch abort, eight Super Dracos are expected to fire for five seconds at full thrust. The development of the engine is partially funded by NASA's CCDEV-2 program. Super Dracos will be used on both the Crew Dragon and on the Dragonfly rocket, a prototype low-altitude reusable rocket that will be used for flight testing various aspects of the propulsive landing technology. While the engine is capable of 73,000 newtons lbf of thrust, during use for Dragonfly testing, the engines will be throttled to 68,170 newtons lbf to maintain vehicle stability. First firing of all eight Super Draco engines took place on the 6th of May 2015 at 9 a.m. Eastern Standard Time at the SpaceX Crew Dragon Pad abort test. Super Draco engines are capable of being restarted many times and have the capability to deeply reduce their thrust, providing precise control during propulsive landing of the Dragon capsule. SpaceX have since announced they will not be using propulsive landing on the Dragon 2. As of 2015, Super Draco is the third most powerful engine developed by SpaceX, approximately 200 times more powerful than the Draco thruster engines, and only outmatched by the Raptor and Merlin. By comparison, it is more than twice as powerful as the Kestrel engine that was used in SpaceX's Falcon 1 launch vehicle second stage, and about one-ninth the thrust of a Merlin 1D engine. In addition to the use of the Super Draco thrusters for powered landings on Earth, NASA's Ames Research Center is studying the feasibility of a Dragon-derived Mars lander for scientific investigation. Preliminary analysis indicates that the final deceleration will be within the retro propulsion Super Draco thruster capabilities. Topic: 
Topic See also Kestrel Merlin Raptor